What is up YouTube and welcome to this Supergirl Season 2 finale video. So if you haven't seen the Supergirl Season 2 finale, this video will of course contain spoilers. And I'm sorry if you continue on, I cannot be held responsible for your spoilers. So if you're new to the channel, a subscribe is super appreciated if you enjoy the video and a like as well of course. So Supergirl Season 2 ended on a very very somber note there as we had a very sad song playing over the top of Monel leaving this planet and then that is it now i am a notable hater of Monel i was not a fan of the character one bit i am a fan of the character in the comics but i feel that they really really did make a huge misstep with the portrayal of mon -El. Now I love, love, love that people enjoy the Caramel ship because it brings them joy and I love what makes people happy. But I do not like that ship one bit, sadly. I do ship Lena Corp or Super Corp or whatever that ship is called with her and Lena. Now that is very uh, progressive to say the least. But Nonetheless, Monel is now gone from the show. Seemingly, he is gone. But what the hell is actually going on? So we see him leave the planet, and then later on in the episode, just a few minutes later, we see him in space, just like, oh, well, uh, oh, crap, I'm in space, and what do I do? I mean, he didn't even take a Kindle, he didn't take an iPad, or just like, or even a book, an old fashioned book would have done. But we see him have a portal, we see a portal appear, and then he is sucked into this portal, which, well, in my opinion, is definitely the Phantom Zone. If you'll remember, obviously Supergirl was sucked into the Phantom Zone, was thrown off course, stuck in the Phantom Zone, and then she has escaped and landed on Earth years later, after when... Her, her cousin actually landed on the planet and she was not aged at all. So what the hell is going on? So the reason he actually left the planet was the Earth's atmosphere or air was going to contain lead, which was the ultimate final solution against the evil Daxamites, which makes sense because they are totally allergic to the old lead. It's not like a gluten allergy. It really does actually fucking kill them. But the Daxamites are gone. Monel is gone. So this has a very big connection to the comics. So originally, when Largand or Monel landed on Earth, he was convinced that he was a Kryptonite or Kryptonian. Even it wasn't just a ball of Kryptonite. He was with Superboy, and Superboy tricked him by using a kryptonite look-alike so he used a lead made it look like kryptonite but then it turned out that well he was a daxamite who was really totally allergic to lead of course and then what happened is as time went on uh, monel or largand as he later became or later was actually named which is the name of monel's father in the show who was totally properly shanked by Terry Hatch's Queen Raya, well, what happens is he is then transported into the Phantom Zone using the portal in the Fortress of Solitude, and then years later he is found by the Legion of Superheroes, and Brainiac 5 manages to help or have the cure for this. And then later on, he joins the Legion of Superheroes. Now, the Legion of Superheroes has been referenced twice on the Arrowverse, at least. We have had it featured... Well, the ring was featured in the all those premonition kind of Speed Force things that we saw on The Flash. And the ring is also in The Fortress of Solitude in Supergirl. So I can't help but think they are finally going to pay off and reference the Legion of Superheroes in some way, shape, or form. But I kind of find it weird. I find it really weird that what they would do is actually have him in the future, have the Legion of Superheroes, 
and then we have our super good in the present time. So I'm not sure how that would actually work. I think you could possibly have a flash forward kind of thing and then they could bring Monel back to his original time because Legion of Superheroes do love that whole wibbly wobbly timey wimey stuff, don't they? They love a good time travel. But let me know what you think. Do you like this idea? Do you like him joining the Legion of Superheroes in the season three? So that is it for this video. Please drop a like. Please subscribe. I'll see you soon and goodbye.